Hi, in this video, we will show you how to uh, deal with uh, atherosclerosity in, uh, in stata regressions. So, atherosclerosity is uh, a very important hypothesis that is uh, needed to, uh, to check when running linear regression. So, uh, alongside of normality and uh, non autocorrelation of error term, we should also uh, check the uh, atherosclerosity of uh, the homoscedacity of error term. So, when, etero, uh, when error term are Heteroscedastic. There are statistical techniques that are used in order to uh, correct uh, uh, to to fix this issue. So, uh, for the purpose of the video, we have uh, a data containing information on of GGP, the gross fixed capital formation, general government final consumption, as well as uh, GDP growth and uh, gross fixed capital formation. And general government investment. So we will run a linear regression and show you how to uh, to, to uh, correct the uh, heteroscedacity. So and it's the first time you are watching one of my video. Do not hesitate to subscribe and activate the notification bell in order not to lose the next publication. And a like or a thumbs up will be a pleasure. It's really very interesting to know that. Uh, Effort we are making are uh, helping you improve your uh, statistical model for social sciences level. So uh, we'll uh, first of all start by uh, running a linear regression using the command regress. We use the command regress to regress uh, variable as dependent variable uh, GDP local uh, current local currency. Uh, the independent variable will be the cross fixed capital formation in percentage of GDP. We have uh, general government expenditure, and finally, we have a uh, private sector uh, cross fixed capital formation. Then click on OK. And we can see that uh, the results of our linear regression are already available and we have uh, only a cross fixed capital formation that is a significant uh, because of the p value of the coefficient is less than uh, 5%. So uh, we can try to uh, test for our heteroscedacity by uh, first of all predicting our residual term. So first of all we will generate a variable that uh, we call uh, residuals and we'll use it to test the heteroscedacity of our uh, linear regression model so we'll use the command predict uh, we'll predict the variable called uh, residual and comma uh, with uh, the reserve word resid to say to Stata that uh, variable that is going to be predict is uh, the residual of our linear regression. Then click on OK, and you can see that a new variable called uh, residual uh, has been generated, and we'll use it to test for the scalarity of our error term. So uh, we'll use the command head test followed by. Uh, uh, variable name residual and then click on OK and you can see that uh, the p-value of our heteroscedacity test is uh, 0 0.0054 that which is uh, less than 5% meaning that uh, our error term uh, entailing the rejection of the null hypothesis of uh, homoscedacity so uh, our error term are uh, just heteroscedastic. So, how to uh, correct the uh, heteroscedastic? Uh, one option is to use a uh, variance robust option of Hacker and White in order to have uh, a model that have error term that uh, follow the heteroscedastic. Uh, it, it, that are almost classic so we'll just uh, run our moral comma and uh, use the reserve word uh, robust robust 
and then uh, we'll estimate a new model that uh, have uh, the property property of uh, variance or robust of uh, robust variance of uh, hacker white so then we click on uh, OK and you can see that the result of our uh, variable appear with uh, different in uh, significant of coefficient uh, with not a high difference in uh, coefficient uh, value but uh, this model that has been estimated by uh, the uh, meet the, the robust option half is uh, consistent is uh, half error term that are not uh, heteroscedastic but rather almost scedastic so that's it for this uh, tutorial and we hope it have uh, helped you understand how to uh, deal with heteroscedasty in linear regression and if you have not done so do uh, subscribe and activate the notification bell in order not to lose the next uh, video